everybody! I'm Eep the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club! Today I'm here with my friend Wolfie and we're gonna build Wolfie his own doghouse! Come on! So Wolfie's been such a good boy lately. He's been uh, staying with me in my house and sleeping with me in my bed, but it gets a little crowded. So we're gonna build him his own doghouse now. Come on Wolfie, let's head outside. So we're staying up in our cabin. Come on Wolfie, get out of bed! Oh, I know it's a really comfy bed, but don't worry. Your house is going to be awesome when I'm done with it. Come on. Come on, Wolfie. There you go. That's a good boy. Okay, cool. Now since we're outside, we'll shut the door. And oh, look how beautiful it is out today. Bright and shiny. Okay, Wolfie. Oh, Wolfie, are you okay? Oh, yeah, he's fine. He's, he's a good boy. Well, I think we should build his uh, house right around here. Right, Wolfie? This is where his old house was, so may as well start here. Come on. So I put this chest out here with a bunch of doghouse building supplies. So let's start off by grabbing some bricks and some oak slabs, and let's get some dirt too. Now, I think this is a good starting area, but I think we could make it a little bit bigger. So let's put some dirt down here to make it a little bit wider. What do you think of that, Wolfie? <laughs> I'm so excited to have a new little wolf friend. He's been so much fun to have around. He loves playing fetch and having treats. And oh, have you guys ever tried a dog treat before? They're really icky. <laughs> I tried one the other day when I gave Wolfie a treat because it looks like a cookie or like a, a biscuit that you would get with some, uh, some tea or hot chocolate. And trust me, it does not taste like a cookie or a biscuit. <laughs> but Wolfie seems to like them, so I, I give them to Wolfie. Dogs eat lots of interesting things, but they also eat a lot of things they shouldn't, like toys and socks. I found Wolfie chewing on some of my shoes before, and, and I tell him, you can't do that, Wolfie, it's bad for you. But he just won't listen to me sometimes. So I think this is gonna be big enough for the base of Wolfie's house. So I'm gonna make the walls out of brick. So we'll put one here and, oh, I'm standing too close and there and there and yeah. Oh yeah, you like that Wolfie. You like the view, don't you? It's super cool. Oh, get out of there Wolfie. I don't wanna build bricks over you. <laughs> so we're gonna put some more here and he's just following me around. He's so excited. Oh, we go on walks all the time, and it's so much fun. Sometimes when we're out on walks, Wolfie will start digging these big holes in the ground, just like other doggies. <laughs> I sometimes wish I could be a dog. It's a lot of fun being a mouse, but to be a dog would be so cool. You can go outside and play with other dogs and digging a bunch of holes. I wonder why dogs dig holes. Are they trying to get to the other side of the earth? I think that Teddy once told me that dogs dig because they like to bury their things like bones and, and other foods. And they do that just in case they get hungry for later, like saving snacks. Isn't that right, Wolfie? <laughs> oh, he's so silly. So let's see, I built a wall here. So, oh, well, I'm gonna put a brick here and jump on top and we're gonna build it one layer higher and then I'll make a roof for it. Oh, you like that, Wolfie. <laughs> He's such a good doggy. So much fun. Oh, but, you know, I also really like playing with Wolfie. Like I said before, we like to play fetch, but we also like to play hide and seek. And sometimes we'll, uh, we'll play fight together. Now, when you play fight with a doggy, they'll bark at you and sometimes try to bite you. But they'll never actually bite you or hurt you. That would be mean. And that's how they play, so they can pretend to hunt. It's especially good for wolves because it's really important that they can catch their own food. But Wolfie doesn't need to do that now, because I'm taking care of him. Isn't that right, Wolfie? Oh, are you stuck in the wall there? Get out of there. Oh, Wolfie, you're so silly. Come on now. Okay, so I've built some walls here, but you know, Let's, let's build the roof next. I'm gonna put the roof on the top there and then I'll decide how I wanna build the rest of it. So I'm gonna make the roof out of some, some white wool and some red wool. So let's see here, we'll put one here and here. There we go, there we go. 
That's good. I like that. You like that, Wolfie? Yeah. He's a good boy. Oh, man. Wolfie's never seen uh, anything else but snow before. He's never been, like, down where I live. I was talking to him about it before, and I was telling him about that we like to go swimming, and in the summertime it's warm out, and we have all sorts of fun. I really one day would like to bring Wolfie down from the mountain to show him what a swimming pool is. He's only ever been swimming in really cold water, and I think it would be cool if he could try swimming in a swimming pool with me and my Mother Goose Club friends. Do you guys like swimming? I love swimming, it's so much fun. It's fun to do with friends too, and you can play all sorts of games like, like Marco Polo and, and just uh, having swimming races. It's a lot of fun. Okay, how do you like that, Wolfie? Oh, you're going exploring? Okay, well, he's probably getting a little bored because he can't build. Well, let's see, it's a little dark in here, so I'm gonna put some torches back here. There we go, that's one and two. Oh, see, now he's excited. Three, there we go. Oh, so the floor's made of dirt here, so I'm thinking I'm gonna dig some of that dirt out to build a floor. That'll be nice. So let's see, one, two, there we go. And I'm gonna build the floor out of some wooden planks. That way it can be just a little bit lower, but not a full block lower than the rest of it. I think Wolfie will really like that. And oh, that means there's gonna be some dirt on the side here. Well, I'll just dig that out and replace it with some, uh, some bricks here. I think that'll be nice. I think Wolfie will like that. Oh, this house is gonna be so cool. I love getting to build in Minecraft. It's so much fun. Uh, I, I built my whole house there. I built it when I first came up to the mountain and it was so fun to do. I had to do it quickly though before it got too cold out. But I like building at home with my friends Jack and Mary. It's a lot of fun. Oh, I also like building with other things like Legos. <gasps> Have you guys ever built with Legos before? They're so much fun. Oh, it's just so cool. Let's see how this is looking. Hmm. Oh, wow. This house is looking great. Wolfie, Wolfie, come check it out. Yeah, so I'm gonna grab some more, uh, some more bricks and finish up that wall. And then, yeah, I've got, I've got plenty of wood planks. That should be enough. And then I can uh, get building the flooring. Okay, so let's see, we're gonna put one here, and oh, looks like I missed one, uh, one uh, dirt block there. There we go, okay, so we'll put one here. There we go, and there, and there, and mm, there we go. Oh yeah, but besides Legos, I really love Play-Doh. Play-Doh is so much fun, I can build whatever I want out of it. Oh, uh, and you can make some really silly things like ice cream. <gasps> Guys, I love ice cream. My favorite flavor is probably chocolate. Ah, uh, Teddy's favorite flavor is vanilla, but I think chocolate is better. Or chocolate chip. Uh, Wolfie, get out of there. I'm building right there. Oh, you silly doggy, get out of there. Okay, well, looks like I can't get him to move, so I'll start putting down the flooring. So we'll put one here and there. Aw, oh, this is gonna look so cool, Wolfie. Oh, it's gonna be so cozy. Whoopsies. We'll just uh, break that one there. There we go, that's better. Wolfie, you gotta get out of there. I gotta finish building the brick wall there. <laughs> oh, that's a good boy. Let's, let's, uh, let's put in those bricks there. There we go, that's better. Oh yeah, but ice cream, I love it. You know, Wolfie hasn't had ice cream either because he's been up in the snow and you know, Ice cream's fun to have in the winter time, but when it's already so cold out, I get even colder when I have ice cream. But you know, sometimes you really want ice cream, even if it's cold out. <laughs> but yeah, ice cream trucks are great, and they just never seem to come around in the winter time because it's just too cold. <laughs> so let's see. I'm gonna build a little bit more of a wall here, just like that. There we go. And oh, I missed a couple spots up there. Can I reach? Oh, I guess not. Let's get rid of this that I accidentally put down. Oh, man. I should have brought my pickaxe with me. I totally forgot to grab one, I think. There we go. That's better. Well, that's all right for now. Let's see. Right there. There we go. That's better. Oh, yeah. This is looking really good. Okay. So 
What else do I want to add? Oh yeah, okay, I'm gonna put a little fence around here so when Wolfie is in his doghouse, he doesn't have to worry about anything else getting in, like other wolves or, uh, you know, anything else that might be living up here. Like those lava men we saw the other day. That was crazy. Oh, it was so cool, but also kind of scary. Oh, Wolfie, be careful, be careful. Oh, he's fine, he's a good dog. Okay, so let's see. I think that means I need to grab some fences. We'll put the wool back. And let's see, we'll build it right here. There we go. And it can lead right up to my house. And this should be enough room for uh, Wolfie to play in. Yeah, that looks great, awesome, okay. Do we have any, uh, oh cool, we've got a, a, a gate that we can put right here. Oh, oops, that was a fence. There we go, a gate right there. Let's uh, open that up. Oh yeah, it's looking really good in here. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna dig up some of this snow to get it out from here. I don't want it to be cold in here for Wolfie. I think this is looking like a really good base for a doghouse. I could add a lot more cool stuff, but I think I'm gonna do that later. I wanna go out and play with Wolfie in the snow. We're gonna play fetch with snowballs. It's gonna be so much fun. But first, I think we're gonna need a nap. I'm getting pretty tired from all the building and crafting I did. Come on in here, Wolfie. Yeah, there you go. So we'll tie that up right there. And we'll close that. You like it so far, Wolfie? You got a little bit to play out here and a view of the whole mountainside. Oh, you're such a good boy, Wolfie. Oh, he's so cute. Oh man, this has been so much fun, you guys. Thank you so much for playing with me today. Oh, Wolfie's house is crazy. It's so cool in here. It's almost big enough for me to live in. <laughs> well, thank you so much for playing with me again. Bye from the Mother Goose Club. Bye. Hey everybody, I'm Eat the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm in my library reading some books. I'm just about to start reading Jack and the Beanstalk and <gasps> oh, what's that smell? Oh, something smells terrible. Oh, what could it be? Oh, I don't see anything up in my bedroom that it could be. Maybe there's something in the kitchen. Maybe I burned something earlier. There's nothing on the furnace. And there's nothing around here, no rotten apples or potatoes. Oh, but it still smells terrible. Oh, I think it's coming from outside. Oh, what could it be? Oh, oh, I don't smell any. Oh, there's nothing over here, just Peter the Pony. And just the park. Oh, it smells so bad, like asparagus or, or cabbage soup. Oh, so stinky. It's not Mary's house. Mary's house smells like flowers. And oh, oh, roses. But these roses are kind of stinky. Oh, why are these roses so smelly? <gasps> Wolfie, what are you doing over here? <gasps> oh, Wolfie, you're the stinky smell. It's you. Oh, you smell so bad. Oh, is that why you're hiding in the roses to try and smell better? Oh, you smell so dirty. Well, do you know what that means, Wolfie? It's time for a bath. Come on now. Oh, where are you going, Wolfie? Wolfie, no, don't run away. Oh, guys, Wolfie's really scared of taking baths. He doesn't like the water. Oh man, I totally forgot. Normally when uh, Wolfie has to take a bath, I have to trick him into getting into the tub. Oh, this is gonna be so tricky, but let's head after him. It's really important to get clean, guys. You can get sick if you're dirty for too long. You get really smelly. And people don't like hanging out with smelly people sometimes, you know? Oh, but, oh, this field of flowers smells really nice. Oh, that orange flower smells really good. And so do these red tulips. Oh, man, so good. Oh, what's your favorite smell? My favorite smell is definitely flowers. Oh, oh, or some cheese. Cheese is so good. I know a lot of people think cheese is really stinky, but I think it smells great. Oh, that's what's so cool about smells. Something that smells kind of gross to you might smell really good to someone else. 
Whoa, but check it out! Look at this, it's a pretty lagoon! Wow! And look at this clean water! It's so cool! Oh no, look, it's a zombie! Oh, get out of here, zombie! Take that and that! Oh man, why was there a zombie over here? <gasps> There's more! And he's getting in the water! Oh no, you're gonna make the water dirty! <gasps> Wolfie, be careful! Stay back! Oh, Wolfie! Oh, he's helping me get the zombies! Get out of here, zombies! Get out of the water! You're gonna make it all dirty and gross! Take that! Oh, there's one right in the middle of the water there! Come here, zombie! We're not gonna hurt you! Uh, but, uh, take that! Uh, oh, man! Come, come on, zombie! Get out of the water! Don't, don't make it even more dirty! Oh, Wolfie, you got him! Oh, you, you helped me save! Oh, Wolfie, you're great! You're awesome! You helped me get rid of all the zombies! Oh, that was so cool! Oh, man, thank you so much, Wolfie! Oh, and check out this lagoon! Oh, Wolfie, you, you're still pretty stinky, though! Oh, uh, that was so smelly! Oh, uh, Wolfie, you really conquered your fears by helping me defeat all those zombies! Maybe, maybe you could conquer your fears of, uh, taking a bath! And, uh, take a bath with me in this here lagoon! What do you say? Are you ready to conquer your fears, Wolfie? Okay. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Let's uh, let's get out of this dark cave. And we can uh, jump in the water right here and get clean together. Because, you know, I'm a little stinky from fighting all those zombies. Yeah, just look at us, Wolfie. We're both pretty stinky from fighting those zombies. And, well, you, you were stinky in the first place. So, that's all right, though. We're going to take care of it. We're going to jump in together. Are you ready, Wolfie? Okay, let's, uh, let's, uh, on the count of, of five, when I hit one, we jump in together, okay? Five, four, three, two, one, and jump! Wah! Blub, blub, blub. Oh, we're, we're doing it! We're swimming! Oh, Wolfie, where are you? Oh, there you are! Look, you're not really stinky anymore! Oh, see, isn't this fun? Oh, I just love playing in the water! Yeah, look at you! Oh, you smell nice and clean, Wolfie, and oh, look, you jumped back in. Oh, see, isn't this so much fun? See, water isn't that scary. It's really awesome that you conquered your fears, and really awesome that you got clean, too. And I also got clean. <laughs> yeah, it's really important to stay clean, because, you know, you're really fun to play with, Wolfie, but it's really hard to play with you when you're so stinky sometimes. <laughs> Oh, man, I had so much fun, you guys. Oh, and I'm glad Wolfie is nice and clean now. Come and play with us again soon. See you next time for more Minecraft. Bye! Hey, everybody. I'm Eat the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm hanging out on top of the mountain by my log cabin. And I've just finished building most of Wolfie's house. Come on, let's check it out. So... I was building the rest of his house earlier, and you know, it looks really good for a dog house. It's really big, but you know what? I was thinking about it, and I think I could make it even bigger and even nicer. Isn't that right, Wolfie? I bet you'd like that. So I decided that, you know what? I'm gonna make it even better, and I'm gonna make it even bigger. So I got a bunch of supplies together to make this house awesome, and I realized I wanna take this back wall and uh, send it out even farther so it makes the house even longer. But to do that, I'm gonna have to get rid of all those bricks and all that wood. And you know what? I could dig it all out with a pickaxe or I could use some TNT and just blow the whole thing up back there. That'll make so much room for me to build a whole nother part of the house. Yeah, Wolfie, okay, stay out here. Stay away from the house while I get the TNT set up and get ready to explode it. <laughs> so let's see, let's grab some TNT. We've got some flint and steel here. So Wolfie, I'm gonna tie you up. No, 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 don't go in there. I have to go in there and put some TNT down, okay? So I'm gonna take you over this way and put you inside the house, okay? I don't want you to get hurt, all right? So stay right here, okay? I'll be back, I promise. I just want to make sure that Wolfie doesn't get hurt. TNT can be really dangerous if you're not careful. So, Wolfie, no, how'd you get back out 
here. Okay, okay, how about this? We're gonna put it down here and here. And Wolfie, I'm sorry, but we're gonna have to, uh, you're gonna have to follow me and stay all the way over here, okay? I'm gonna sit you down inside the house where you'll be nice and safe, okay? And you can't follow me, all right? You can't follow me, okay, Wolfie? I understand that you wanna see the explosion, but I don't want you to get hurt, okay? So stay right here, all right? I'll be right back, okay? Oh, he's a good boy, so I think I'll stay there this time. So let's get out the flint and steel, and let's uh, light up this TNT and get away as fast as we can so we don't get hurt, okay? So we'll, there we go. Okay, I let the TNT, let's go, let's get out of here. Oh boy, okay, oh! Oh, sweet, the whole back of the house has been blown up. Oh man, there's so much more room here now. You know, I think I need to put down one more TNT to get the back of the wall here. So we'll put it right here. There we go. And we'll just light that real quick and take a step back and that should get rid of everything else. Oh yeah, look at it. Oh, that, oh awesome, that was perfect. That was just the perfect amount I needed. Oh, this leaves plenty of room for me to build more for Wolfie. Okay, I'm gonna bring him back outside so he can see how things look. <laughs> I'm coming, Wolfie, don't worry. Okay, hi, Wolfie. Oh, you're being a good boy. Yeah, you can come outside now, come on. I'll leave the doors open so you can come out when you're ready. You gonna come, Wolfie? Okay, so I'm gonna start building the rest of your house up. So let's see. Let's first fill in all of these holes here. So we'll put, oh, looks like I'm out of dirt. Let's go and grab some more in my chest. There we go, that should be plenty. And you know, let's grab some more wool, just in case. Yeah, see Wolfie, look! I know it's kind of sad that some of your doghouse is gone, but I promise there's gonna be more there soon. It's gonna be even cooler. Okay, I I, I got some, uh, uh, some carpet. Yeah, some carpet, and we're gonna put that down on your floor, and it's gonna be super cool, okay? So let's see, let's grab some more bricks and build this out a little bit more. So let's see, we'll add some there, and we'll put some more uh, some more dirt down. Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. You know, I love explosions, they're so much fun. They can be really dangerous sometimes, like when creepers explode, that's pretty bad, but you know, Otherwise, explosions can be a lot of fun. It's fun to kind of destroy things sometimes and see what happens, you know? So, okay, I accidentally put that brick down. It's really hard to pick up without a pickaxe. So, I'm, uh, I'll get a pickaxe later. But for now, I'll just uh, start building the rest of this up. So let's see. Oh, oh, looks like I'm out, okay. Man, I should have been prepared. I should have grabbed everything out of the chest. Well, that's all right. You guys don't mind. It's all for fun here. I love crafting. I know, I know I've said that before, but it's so much fun. Oh yeah, and uh, all my friends like to build too. Build all sorts of things. Jack likes to build, Mary likes to build. Mary can fix cars, did you know that? She's so cool. I'm not very good at fixing cars, but I can build dog houses really well. <laughs> but yeah. It's been so much fun hanging out with Wolfie. He's a really good dog. Oh, where'd, where'd you go, Wolfie? Wolfie! Oh, man. Uh, sometimes, though, even though he's a lot of fun to play with, he's got really stinky breath. Really gross dog breath. Have you guys ever smelt dog breath? It can be really nasty sometimes. Ugh, just pee you! Ugh! It was really stinky so stinky and I have no idea what makes doggy breath smell so bad I wonder if it's vegetables oh yeah that would make sense some vegetables can be really gross sometimes like I really don't like asparagus do you guys like asparagus I'm not really a fan I think it's really stinky and it it, it makes me feel kind of sick I really just I don't like I don't like asparagus that's that's all I have to say about that. But there are some other vegetables I really do like, like broccoli. I really like broccoli. Uh, it looks just like little trees, and I think that's really cool. Oh, well, let's see. I'm gonna grab a pickaxe and start getting rid of some of these these uh, 
these brick blocks I've put out accidentally. Like that one, there we go. And we'll take this one down, perfect. Okay, so I just have a few more to add. We'll put those here. And let's see, oh, I can't really reach up there. Oh, that's a good idea, Wolfie. I'll, uh, I'll climb up. You gotta scooch over, Wolfie. I gotta, I gotta build a place to climb on top of, okay? And there we go, awesome, perfect. So we'll put some more bricks down. But yeah, I like vegetables, but there are just some that I think are really, really gross. I wonder if Wolfie likes asparagus. That's probably why his breath stinks so much right now. Ugh, so gross. But yeah, okay, cool. So the walls are all built up. So let's get rid of the wool I used to climb on top of. Oh yeah, it's looking great, Wolfie. And let's put down the flooring. We'll put some here. And oh, looks like I ran out. Let's grab some more. And then we can put the roof in. <gasps> I have a really good idea. What if instead of just making the roof out of wool, we add a skylight, we add some, some glass window panes in so Wolfie can see the stars when he's sleeping inside at night. <gasps> That'll be so fun. Wouldn't that be cool looking, Wolfie? Oh yeah, we're totally doing that. Uh, I just, I love getting to build things. And I like that uh, I can make Wolfie's house even better than it was before. Oh, Wolfie, you're gonna have to get out of there. I gotta build right there, okay? Oh, come on, scooch over, Wolfie. Okay, there we go, that's a good boy. Okay, cool, awesome. So let's build some of the roof back. And then I'll build, oopsies. Then I'll build the rest of it with some window pane. That should work fine. Oh, and I forgot to get rid of these here. There we go, one, two. Oh, oops, looks like I messed up there. We'll, uh, we'll grab some here, put it right there, and then put some flooring down. Boom, awesome, perfect, okay. And then I should be able to build some more of the roof. So we'll put them here. Oh man, I love the stars, they're so cool. And uh, the fact that they make constellations is pretty cool too. Do you guys know what constellations are? They're, when, uh, they're groups of stars that uh, are all together. And what they do is they uh, sometimes form pictures about with stories about uh, all sorts of cool things like other creatures and people. It's really fun to hear about. Teddy tells me about stories from constellations all the time. It's super fun. Okay, so let's see. I need the glass pane for the roof now, which I totally forgot to grab. So we'll grab it here. There we go, some glass panes. We'll stick that over there. Oh yeah, this is looking so much better already. Okay, so let's see. We're gonna put one here. Oh, oops, we'll just, uh, we'll leave that for now. We'll put it right there, and right there, and there, and, oh, whoa, it's making such a cool pattern. I don't know if this is gonna keep all the, uh, um, the snow and the rain out, but it sure looks cool. And you know what? When you're building things sometimes, there's, uh, some happy accidents that can happen, and they look really neat sometimes, too. I'll have to fix it later, but for now, this looks really cool. Oh, and it lets some air in too. That's awesome. Oh, let's let's get rid of this one. Oopsies. We'll break these. Smash, smash. There we go. Oh, you like that, Wolfie? Yeah, and we can even have some of the daylight coming in. And we'll put up a couple torches. And yeah, this is looking awesome. Okay, I'm gonna grab some of the carpet. And then, you know, I think this is everything that I wanted to uh, to add to Wolfie's house, so it's looking pretty cool. Oh man. Well, oh, that's kind of weird. Oh, the, the carpet isn't touching the ground. Oh, I get it. Because we put uh, some wooden slabs down, it's a, uh, there's some space between one block and the next. So it looks like the, uh, the carpet is hovering above the ground. Oh man, that's so weird. I kind of like it though. You know what? I think I'm gonna keep it. Oh, oh, I have a really good idea. Let's grab some more slabs and it can be like a little play area. Oh yeah, with some steps. Okay, okay. This is gonna look so cool, guys. Check it out. Okay, Wolfie, what are you doing? Oh, he's such a silly wolf. So we'll put some more down here. Wolfie, get out of there. Oh. Come on, Wolfie. Oh, what a silly dog. Well, he should be okay, let's see. We'll grab some of these and we won't need 
the TNT anymore because I don't uh, plan to explode this house anymore today. Maybe a different day, but not right now. Wolfie, there you go. That's a good boy. So let's see. Oh, yeah, so it's like a step up. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, it's perfect. And we'll put some on top of these planks here. See? Problem solved. Sometimes mistakes lead to really cool things happening. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. I love it. Okay. So I like how that looks, and I think Wolfie does too. Wolfie, where'd you go? Wolfie, come back. Huh. Oh, there he is. Oh, see, look, he went him all by himself. Oh, isn't this cool, Wolfie? Isn't it a cool place? Oh, man. And don't worry, I'll patch up the holes in this skylight in a little bit. Don't worry. I didn't know that the glass panes would do such cool looking things. But uh, they're not going to keep out the rain, and that's what's important. So I'll take care of that some other day, Wolfie. Uh, you should uh, check it out a little bit, though. Oh, it just looks so cool. Oh, it's awesome. I love building things, guys. Thank you so much for building more of Wolfie's house, house with me. Come back next time. We might build even more things for Wolfie. Bye from the Mother Goose Club. Bye. Hey, everybody. I'm Eep the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm vacationing in this log cabin on a snowy mountaintop. You see, it's summertime back down the mountain at the clubhouse, and it's been so hot out. So I decided to come up here to this beautiful winter wonderland to get, a, to get some fresh air and cool down. Look how pretty it is. And look, there's even a waterfall in my backyard of this cabin. It's so cool. But I'm also going to go and have some, some winter fun up here. I want to go outside and play. Come on. Let's go and uh, play uh, some fun things in the snow. Oh, some of my favorite things to do in the snow are build snowmen and make snow angels. Oh, or have snowball fights. They're so much fun. Huh. Did you hear that? I think I heard something. There it is again. Oh, I wonder what it was. I think I think it's coming from this way. Let's let's go check it out. Oh, it's getting a little bit louder. I hope it's not a yeti or an abominable snowman. Oh, that would be scary. Oh, it's even louder now. What if it's it's Santa? Well, that would be weird. Santa doesn't make noises like that. It's really loud. It's, it's coming from this snowbank here. Oh, oh no, it's right next to a mountain. What if there was an avalanche and someone's stuck in here? Oh, well, let's grab my, my shovel and dig them out. Hello? Is anybody in there? Don't worry, Eep's gonna save you. Hello? Hello? Oh! Oh, it was a oh, it was a wolf that was stuck in here. Hey, hey, Wolfie. Oh, look at this poor wolf. I bet you he's so cold and hungry. Oh, are you okay? Oh, he looks okay. That was probably pretty scary being stuck in there. Well, well here, I was eating chicken on the way up, and now I have a bunch of leftover bones. So Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? You'd like a bone. Well, here, have some bones. Oh, Wolfie, don't go that way. Here, here. I hear bones, uh, <laughs> wolves love bones. There you go. Have another. Have a few. <gasps> oh, I think he really liked that. I think we're friends now. Hey there. Oh, what a cute wolf. What a good boy. Oh, Wolfie the wolf. Yeah, that's what I'm going to call you. Wolfie the wolf. Oh, he's so cute. Well, come on, Wolfie, let's let's play in the snow together since we're friends now. Oh, I have a great idea. How about we uh, uh, have a snowball fight? Do you like snowball fights? Oh, I love snowball fights. Oh man, let's check, let's uh, okay. So to have a snowball fight, you get some snow and you roll it into these balls here and then you throw them at each other like this. Okay, Wolfie, get ready. Can you catch it? Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. <gasps> What's this? Oh my gosh, look guys. It's a snow golem. Oh, that's so cool. Maybe he wants to play with us too. Well, Wolfie, uh, you must be tired from the, the ordeal you had. So we, we don't have to play snowball fights. We don't have to do that. Well, how about we, we head back to my cabin and we can have maybe a snack or... <gasps> I have a great idea. I'm going to build you a dog house. That way we can be neighbors. Oh, that would be so cool. Come on, 
Wolfie, let's uh, let's uh, I'm gonna show you where I live. Come this way, Wolfie. There you are. Let's go. So, this is where I stay when we come on vacation up here. It's so much fun. But oh, there you are. Here, let's put you on a, a lead so we don't lose you. So this is where we vacation up on the mountaintop. It's such a cozy little cabin, and uh. Me and my friends built it ourselves! And don't worry, I'll build you a nice, cozy doghouse, too! It'll be so cute! And so much fun! Oh yeah! You coming, Wolfie? Oh, that's a good boy! So, so check it out! This is my house! Isn't it cool looking? Oh, I really like it, but... Hmm, let's see, where would be a good place to build your doghouse? We've got... Oh! Did you fall? Are you okay, Wolfie? Oh, what a, what a silly wolf. Do you need help? Can you not get up? Oh no, he's got it. He's fine. He's a strong wolf. <laughs> but, but come over here. Oh, this would be the perfect spot to build a doghouse. Plenty of space and it's right next to mine. Let's see. I've got some red wool here that would be perfect for your doghouse. So, we're going to build it right here. So, we'll build the back wall here. And, oh, Wolfie, you're in the way. Scoot over. I, I can't get in there if you're standing right there. I know you're excited, but... Oh, oh, wow. It's starting to snow. Oh, look at that, guys. It's so pretty. It really is a winter wonderland here. <gasps> Isn't this cool, Wolfie? It's so pretty. Oh, and it's starting to get pretty chilly out, too. Well, I guess I can wait to finish. Oh, yeah, look, and there's snow getting on top of this here. I don't I don't think I can finish building your doghouse tonight. You know, let's just build it tomorrow. How about we go inside and have a snack instead? And you can stay at my place tonight. It'll be like a sleepover. Oh, it'll be so much fun. Okay, so check it out, Wolfie. Oh, where'd you go? Come on, come on, Wolfie, this way. Oh, what a silly dog. There you go. <laughs> oh, he's such a silly wolf. He's so cute, though. I'm glad that we're friends and we met, Wolfie. Oh, oh, check this out, though. I gotta show you something super cool. So, this is our back porch, and we have a beautiful view of the mountaintops. Look how pretty it is with all of the ice trees and the waterfall. It's so cool, right? And, and look, when it snows, even some snow gathers on the porch here, which makes it great for for getting snowballs and, and having snowball fights. But I, I know you don't want to have any more snowball fights. You're, you're probably really tired. We should, let's, let's go inside and uh, I'll make us something to eat. I brought up some food down from the clubhouse when I came up here. And uh, let's see what we have here. We've got some carrots and oh, a fish. Let's cook a fish up. I really like carrots, but you know, I'm just not that hungry for carrots, but I'm really, I really want some fish. So let's, uh, let's cook that up in the furnace. Oh, you like my bed, Wolfie? It's really comfy. You can, you can hang out there while I cook up our fish. So let's see here. In order to cook fish in the furnace, I need some coal. And let's see, we're gonna put the coal in the furnace. And then we put the fish in. And then the fish cooks. Oh, look at that, so warm and toasty in here. Ain't that great, Wolfie? Oh, he's sitting on my bed. He's such a good boy. You really like that. Well, don't worry. I'll be sure to make a place for you to sleep nice and comfy in your doghouse when I get the chance to finish it. Oh, it's so nice in here. Oh, Wolfie, where'd you go? Oh, yeah, and that's my anvil. That's where uh, I go and sharpen my sword and, and fix things if things break. Hey, it's really easy to do, and it's way better than going to having uh, having to go out and buy another shovel, another shovel or sword or anything like that. <laughs> yeah, and that's my crafting table. Yeah, we can build all sorts of things there. It's so fun. Let's see how that fish is coming though. <gasps> it's cooked. Yes, perfect. Oh, and we'll leave the coal on the fire to keep this place nice and warm. Oh, look how good it looks. I love fish. Do you want any, Wolfie? No? Not, not feeling like any fish? You only like bones? Okay. Well, I'll give you some more bones when I finish this fish up. Oh, uh, I just love fish. It's so tasty. Oh, it's just the tastiest thing. Well, you know, I'm actually... 
I'm not that hungry right now. I'll save the fish for later because I I don't want to eat unless Wolfie's eating too. So maybe maybe we could have some carrots instead. Wolfie, do you like carrots? Here. Do you like carrots, Wolfie? Oh, all right, okay. It looks like you only like bones. Well, I like carrots. They're really tasty. So, oh, well, I'm not that hungry right now. We'll just have to give it another shot later. Oh, I'm sorry, Wolfie. I didn't mean to throw that snowball at you. I just got excited. Well, looks like you're pretty tired and I want to take a nap. I get it. Well, I'm pretty tired, too. We should head in for the day. Oh, I had so much fun making friends with Wolfie and hanging out with you guys. Well, I had so much fun. Come and play with us again soon. Bye from the Mother Goose Club. Bye. Hey, everybody. I'm Eat the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm at Old McDonald's Farm. Let me show you around. Come on. So this is Old McDonald's Farm. He's got this big barn here and all this land where he lets all of his animals walk around. And look, here's one of his small crop fields. Look at all of the stuff he has. He's got some pumpkins and watermelons and some of these other crops here. I wonder what they'll grow into. And look over here. Looks like he's got some wheat growing for his animals that live in the barn. Let's go check him out, guys. Me and my friends love coming to Old McDonald's farm every now and again. It's just so much fun. Check it out. He's got all of these cool sheep. They're inside the barn because they're special. They're colored sheep. Look, there's a pink one and a purple one and an orange one, even green. <laughs> they're so cool. But then he also has three horses here. See, look, a brown one, a gray one, and What's this? Oh no! It looks like one of the horses must have escaped. It looks like someone didn't tie him up and left his gate open to his stable. Oh no! Well, I better help old McDonald out and find him one. Find him the horse that he lost. Well, I could just go out there, but I should prepare. I should get a bunch of supplies to make sure when I find the horse, I can get him back home. Let's see, we'll need a saddle, a lead, a bunch of apples, as many as we can. Did you know that horses love apples? Just like me! <laughs> and some sugar for a treat? And I don't think we'll need any hay. This should be plenty. And I'll take some potions with me too, just in case the horse got hurt while he was out adventuring. Oh no, I hope that's not the case. Okay, horsies, I'm gonna find your pony friend. All right, let's head out. You sheepies be good, you horses be good. Old Eep will be back with our other horse friend before you know it. All right, so let's look around. We didn't see the horse over in this crops area. Hmm, oh look, sheep. Let's ask the sheep if they've seen a horse. Hey, sheepy, have you seen any horses around? Besides the ones in the barn, I mean. No? No horses? Okay. Looks like that sheep hasn't seen anyone. How about you? Other sheep. Hey, have you seen any horses around? No? All right. Well, hmm. Let's see. Let's cross over the bridge there and see if we can find a horse over there. Around Old McDonald's barn, he's got this cool river that runs through. It's great for growing crops. So I'm gonna head across the bridge now. Let's see, oh, look at this silly sheepy up there. Be careful, sheepy, you don't wanna fall into the lake. Come on over here. Okay, well, did you know sheeps and goats like to climb on mountains? Just like that sheep over there. <laughs> it's really funny sometimes. Look at these piggies and these cows. Hey there, Piggy. Have you seen any horses around? No? No ponies? Okay. What about you, Miss Cow? Have you seen any ponies? No? All right. Well, hmm. I'm not seeing any horses around, unfortunately. Let's see. I don't see anything. How about this? Let's build a lookout tower out of some dirt. Get high up so we can see more of Old McDonald's land, and maybe we'll see the horse from up there. Let's uh, let's do some digging. There we go. Some dirt. Three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ten blocks of dirt should be enough to get pretty high up that we should be able to see around. So let's get building. Okay, so we're gonna jump on here and jump, boop, jump and boop, 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 boop. So that's six. Let's look around from here. Hmm. Wow, look how pretty all of Old McDonald's farm is. He's got some trees that grow apples and another forest and all of his little animals are running around. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, hey, look. Oh, that must be the horse there. That must be the pony. Okay, let's get down from here. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right. Hey there, pony. How are you? Oh, hey friend. Oh, look, he looks just like the other ponies. He's dark brown like his dad, and he's got white spots kind of like his mom. Oh, what a good little pony. Oh, hey there. I've got some treats for you. Let's see. Let's give him some apples. You want some apples, pony? Oh, I think he likes that. Oh, isn't this cool? Oh, what a cute, good pony. Well, I've given him some apples. Let's see if he... Uh, He'll let me ride him. Hey, Pony, uh, we're gonna ride you home, okay? Oh, look at this, oh, he's letting me ride him around. What a good Pony. Oh, did you see that? He loves me, we're friends now. Well, I'm gonna hop off here because I don't wanna ride you bareback. I don't wanna hurt you. So we're gonna hop off here and I'm gonna feed you some more apples to get your strength up for when we head home. Here, <laughs> Okay, so. Looks like he's just raring to get going. Let's put a saddle on him. Let's grab the saddle. And... Hey there, pony. Oh, okay. So let's take the saddle and put it on you right here. There you go, pony. Oh, we should come up for a name for you. How about... Hmm, Peter. Peter the Pony. You like that, Peter? Oh, you're such a good boy. What a good horsey. Well, let's hop on. Wow, I've never ridden a horse before, but I'm really excited. Let's uh, let's head out. Whoa, Peter, you go so fast. Oh no, look at all those creepers over there on the bridge. Those weren't there before. Well, hmm. Let's let's hop off Peter here and make sure he doesn't get hurt. You stay here, Peter. I'm gonna go and uh, check on all those creepers and make sure that they don't uh hurt any of the other animals. Let's uh, let's grab our diamond sword and go check it out. Hey there, creepers, be careful. Don't, don't be mean. Oh no, oh that one exploded right on the bridge. Oh no, oh, ouchies, owies. Oh golly, get out of here, creeper. Oh, oof, wow. Oh no, the bridge. Oh, the creeper blew up this bridge and everything. We can't ride Peter across this. He might fall in. Oh dear. Well, hmm. Let's let's collect a bunch of this uh, this dirt that that creeper exploded and and rebuild the bridge with it. We don't have enough cobblestone to rebuild it completely. So I'll just make it out of dirt until I can talk to Old McDonald about where I can get some more cobblestone. Oh, okay. So let's put some in this hole right here. That's one. We're gonna put some dirt. Oh, I missed. <laughs> We're gonna put some right there. And, oh, Sheepy, what are you doing? Be careful up there. Okay, so, put a bunch of dirt here. Good thing the creeper didn't get you, Mr. Sheepy. Oh, it's important to be careful. So, I think the bridge looks pretty good. Let's fill in this hole a little bit with some dirt, though, so no one can fall in and get hurt, like those sheep or, or any of the piggies or even the cows. We'll just put some here and here, just enough so that no one can get stuck. Okay, you know what? Well, we'll take some of this dirt here and we'll put it in those holes. Because that's the thing about when you have a farm. It's most important to take care of your animals and make sure they're safe. Old McDonald does that all the time. Sometimes we'll come over and he'll show us how to build fences and troughs and feed all the animals so we can take care of them. Okay, Peter, I think we're good to go. Let's head out. Yeah, let's cross the bridge. There.
There we go. Nay! Isn't that right, Peter? <laughs> oh, he's so silly. Oh, man. Well, let's, let's get him back into the barn where he can be safe from creepers and, and not get out. Okay. So let's hop off. And oh, Peter, see, look, it's your mom and dad. Oh, isn't this great? Okay. Let's, uh, let's put a, a lead on you and we'll get you into your stable. There we go. Come on in, Peter. Let's go. Get over here. Oh, oh, do you want some snacks? Are you hungry? Well, I'll put some hay in your stable once we get in, okay? Let's let's go. Ah, there we go. Can you get in, Peter? Oh, oh, it looks like he's too big to get in through the fence there. Let's uh, let's make it a little bigger for him. And then we'll get rid of this. And that should be plenty of room. Come on, Peter. This way, over here. Oh, who's a good boy? Come on over here, Peter. Yeah. Oh, you like that, don't you? Okay, let's put the fence back. And the gate. And, uh-oh. Okay, right there. There you go, Peter. And here we go. Let's tie you up so you don't get out again. We don't want any of those creepers getting at you. Okay, so let's see. Let's put some hay in there. And we can put back these healing potions. I don't need any. Those creepers didn't get me too bad. We'll put the wheat here and the sugar. And oh, look, I collected some seeds while I was out. Let's put those in here for old McDonald. He can use them on his crops sometime. Okay, let's grab the hay. And we're gonna put it right in your stable. We'll put it right here. There you go, Peter. Just for you. Oh, oops. There we go. Some hay for you to eat. And you know what? Looks like uh, your mom and dad are out. Let's let's give them some hay too. Hi, Mama Horsey. Here you go. Here's some hay for you. Just like Peter. Okay. And Daddy Horsey, we'll give you some too. There you go, right there. Perfect. Oh, this is great. Oh, look how excited Peter is. Oh, aren't you a good horsey? Who's a good pony? Well, this has been so much fun. Thank you guys for helping me find Peter the Pony and get him back safe and sound, especially with all those creepers around. You guys will have to come by Old McDonald's farm soon. We can hang out with all the animals. Well, bye-bye from the Mother Goose.